UV sanitizing. Does it work? Are all sanitizers equally effective? The answer to the first question is a resounding yes. UV sanitizing has been trusted for decades by hospitals around the world. The UVC spectrum is a type of shortwave energy that is able to destroy germs at the DNA level. Now, the second question, are all sanitizers effective? The short answer is no. To help you understand the differences, we'll spend some time under the hood, and later we'll do some comparison tests and reveal the results. The main objective of any UVC sanitizer is to deliver enough UVC energy to as many parts of the object as possible. One way to measure that energy is with professionally calibrated UV light meters. Position the sensor where the object will be and detect how much energy is being received at that location. As you can see, the Power UVC Pro delivers over 400 microwatts of UVC energy to the object in all locations. A second more accessible way to measure the UVC dosage is with these amazing new UVC dosimeter cards developed by Intelligo Labs. These mighty little dots are even trusted by industrial-grade hospital sanitizing companies because they can help determine how much UVC energy is being delivered to the object. They start yellow, then will change color depending on how much UV energy is absorbed. A dose of 25 millijoules is known to effectively kill many of the common pathogens. You'll see here that the three-minute cycle time of the Power UVC Pro delivers a consistent and effective kill dosage. Now it's time to compare. We purchased several UVC sanitizers from major retailers to see how they stack up. They all make similar claims, but can they deliver? We placed the dots on a phone and ran the product cycle according to the manufacturer's recommendation. Then we take a look to see how much, if any, UVC energy was detected by the dosimeters. Remember, you don't want to see bright yellow at this stage. Here are the results. As you can see, virtually all of the market samples do not show any noticeable change in the dosimeter after one cycle. This is because the quantity and placement of UVC bulbs is insufficient. Some do appear to be working, but the change is uneven. To be fair, we even ran the products enough times to equal 10 minutes of exposure, which was the longest cycle of the group. Some still had virtually no impact. iHome products have also undergone actual independent lab tests to prove sanitization of various pathogens on objects like phones, watches, and other surfaces. We look forward to more testing and more videos in the future. For now, we hope you feel a bit more informed. Thanks, and see you next time.